Hello kids and welcome to my channel The Curious Panda. I am a Panda teacher and in this video we are going to solve another mathematical problem. Now before we go to the problem I would like to talk to your parents for a minute. Dear parents, if you want your kids to actually ace the Olympiad examination, the best way to do is by practice, practice and practice. And if you want to want your kids to practice more and more previous year question paper, please go to the description box. You will find 18 previous year question paper just for rupees 89. Now back to the video. Okay, so today we are going to solve a data interpretation problem. You will be given a table. Using that table, you have to find the solution to two questions. So this is the gateway to solve two questions in just a minute. So let's go. Let's understand what the question is about. Let's read the question, right? The question says the given pictograph shows the number of bouquets sold by Raman on given five days. So the five days given are Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday and Friday. And Raman is selling nothing but flower bouquets. Study the given pictograph carefully and answer the following question. So on Monday, what we can see in the picture, there are four bouquets given, right? Four bouquet images that are given. And each of this image represents four bouquets. This means that on Monday, Raman had actually sold four plus four plus four plus four. That is... If you add 4 plus 4, 8, 8 plus 4, 12, 12 plus 4, 16. So Raman had sold 16 bouquets on Monday, right? So this is how you have to interpret the data. And subsequently, you would be given two questions. Let's read out the question first. On which day least number of bouquets were sold? Wednesday, Monday, Thursday or Tuesday? You'll find that out. And the second question is how many total bouquets were sold on Monday and Wednesday together? So you will find, have to find that solution to this problem. I'll pause the video for five seconds. But for you, please pause the video now and solve the question. Once you have solved it, we'll go to the solution. So the first question says on which day least number of bouquets were sold? Now, if that is being asked, what you have to see is on which day you can see that the number that the least number of bouquets are sold and you can see here you can uh, see there are four uh, bouquets here you have one two three four five six seven so you have total seven so seven times four here you see there are only three bouquets shown so three times four if you have no multiplication or three times it will be four on thursday it will be one two three four five on Friday again it is 1, 2, 3, 4. So you know that 3 is the, the lowest. So it is on Wednesday that uh, Raman had sold the least number of bouquets. So just it would just take a second for you to answer this kind of a question. Now the second question is how many total bouquets were sold on Monday and Wednesday together? So on Monday we have already found out right that on Monday, if there are four images of four bouquets shown and each Im image of a bouquet actually uh, represents four bouquets. So you had you, we had added four plus four plus four plus four, that is 16 bouquets. So on a Monday, 16 bouquets were sold. On a Wednesday, it was four plus four plus four, that is nothing but four plus four, eight, eight plus four, 12. So nothing but 12 bouquets were sold. So on Monday and Wednesday together, Raman had sold 16 plus 12. That is 28 bouquets. The answer is C. So pretty easy. It's just, uh, you know, some uh, data interpretation and then addition. That's all. And two questions solved within a minute. Right. I hope you would have solved this question correctly. If you have done that, as usual, give yourself a clap and also give yourself a star. If you want to practice more such questions, then you can go to the link below. Uh, the description box will find a link. The link will take you to a uh, last 18 previous year question paper. You can purchase it at just rupees 89 and you will be able to practice more such questions. So we will meet you in the next video. Till then, thank you. Goodbye.